All right, everyone. There's a quick tutorial showing you how to bypass our Windows 7 login. This video is dedicated to Kiran. Okay, so if you're watching this, learn us, learn something. Because last time you're trying to do this, and you know you, you spend like a whole day and nothing happened, right? So I'm making this video just for you. So first, you, you go to Paribay.com and you Google up for Conboot. You click on this one, Conboot 1.1. You download it. Open when you turn it. Now you don't need to download all this crap. Eh? Just um, what you want to do is you want to just want to cd. Dot is to uh, um. Well, it's have a USB one too if you want to. If you want to download, if you want to um, copy this to USB, you can download this one, whichever one. This one is for if you want to burn it to a CD, right? I'll just take this one. I press OK. Let it download finish. And uh, let's go to our um, Windows 7 machine. So you can see here that my um, Windows 7 machine, it have a password. The password is 12345, but let me assume that for some reason I forgot the password. So I type in username and password incorrect, right? So all I'm going to do is just, I'm just going to shut this down. So right, the, um, when you have finished downloading this, what you want to do is either burn it to a CD, which is in my case, I will need to burn it to a CD, or if you download USB, burn it to a USB, right? But you see, I use a virtual machine now, so I don't need to do all of that. I just want to demonstrate to you guys how you can do it. So just go here and click on settings, storage, click on storage. Okay, then you click on add, choose this, um, navigate to the folder where you downloaded con CD, and you click on the ISO. Now, basically, what this is doing is really saying, yeah, um, make a virtual CD drive now and load um, this ISO. This way. But in real life, if you're doing it on a real machine, you're going to want to burn it to a CD or burn it to a USB, whichever one you download, and then boot from it, right? If you don't know how to do that, well, I don't know, use Google or something. And you just press OK. Press Start. And the virtual machine will just boot off from the um, con boot. Did Windows is loading? Okay, now here's the beauty of it, right? It removed the um, it temporarily removed the password for you, so you can just click Enter or the um, sign button, and it works. So I mean, maybe the first thing you want to do is probably to I don't know change your password. But if you don't know how to change your password, well, boy, I suggest I don't know some help or something. But anyway, that's basically it. Okay, but you should know that it only removes the password temporarily, so you might really want to change the password or at least make an next account for you to log in with. Or else you need to log from Conboot every single time, which I don't think will be very feasible. Anyway, later.